Deep in the Ural Mountains, where the wind whispers secrets and the snow hides forgotten stories, lies Dyatlov Pass. In 1959, nine hikers embarked on a winter expedition, their dreams of adventure turning into a chilling nightmare. Their bodies were found scattered, some eerily posed, others bearing strange wounds. What happened that fateful night? Was it an avalanche, a yeti attack, or something even more sinister? Join me, detective as we follow the clues and explore the theories that continue to shroud this incident in mystery. Imagine, nine young, experienced hikers, their tent ripped open from the inside as if fleeing in terror, scattered belongings, a half-built fire, and then their bodies, some miles apart, some with missing eyes and tongues. The official investigation concluded an avalanche, but inconsistencies and strange details fueled speculation. Were they attacked by a hidden predator, like the legendary Mansi tribe's Menk? Did they encounter infrasound, a low-frequency phenomenon known to cause panic and disorientation? Or, as some believe, did they stumble upon a secret military installation, their deaths covered up by a conspiracy? An interviewed expert says the lack of defensive wounds contradicts an animal attack. The radiation levels found on some clothing suggest a possible military connection, but remain inconclusive. The truth, like the mountain itself, remains shrouded in layers of snow and secrecy. Did they witness something they shouldn't have? Did they uncover a hidden truth buried beneath the snow? We may never know for sure. But the Dyatlov Pass incident serves as a chilling reminder of the power of nature, the fragility of life, and the mysteries that still lurk in the shadows, waiting to be unraveled. So, detective, what do you think? Was it an avalanche, a cover-up, or something else entirely? The Dyatlov Pass awaits your verdict. Share your theories in the comments below and let's keep the investigation alive. Remember, in the mountains of mystery, the truth is always just out of reach, waiting to be discovered.